All right, what's up everybody? Another day, another video tour. If you guys are just tuning into this channel for the first time, I'm Chuck, it's Chris Watt with Simply Vegas, your Las Vegas realtor. So today we are here up in Lake Las Vegas, which is on the east side of the city of Henderson. And the home right here that we're going to be touring today is the Voyager, or the Voyage, I'm sorry. As you can see, this is a two-car garage, and we do have a garage for a golf cart, too, as well. This home right here is 2,736 square feet. Features three bedrooms, two and a half bath. The asking price, or the starting the price, the base price on this home is $690,990. Like I said, we are here in Lake Las Vegas. This home definitely has some spectacular view so we're going to go inside and we're going to take a look so within this community here we have three different collections the voyage here is within the collection three it's the highest price for all out of all the collections so as we come right in here to the courtyard pretty decent size now as you can see the um, extra garage for the golf cart it's not attached to the home. It's a detached. You have some stucco eaves, Spanish roof tiles. Now this is a Dell Webb product. The builder is Pulte Homes. So within this community, I think there's about 460 lots. I believe a third of them have been sold. Some of these lots are spectacular. There's so many options and features that you can pick and choose from. Kind of give you a quick rundown here. We're going to start back here from the beginning. See what we have. So as we come through the front door, right off to the left hand side, you do have that formal dining. Then you have this display of the wine chiller. Now I don't know if this one actually has a chiller inside. It doesn't look like it because it's not sealed. But you do have that option for the built out on this. This is a pretty decent size. So you also have an option. Uh, let's see here. This could be a den if you choose to. Or you could also make this across here a bedroom if you choose to as well. So this would actually be your closet right here. Two panel door, really decent sized walk-in closet, that's for sure. This room is 12 by 13. You have 10 foot ceilings. Orange peel texture. Straight edge cornering. Six inches on the baseboards. You got 24 by 24 on the tile. Looks like we have a linen closet here. Look at the uh, thermostat. Looks like we have a Honeywell thermostat. This is a uh, digital. Looks like Sierra Air is the uh, contractors on here. So off to my left, we have a closet. And we have another closet. So this is a sweet queen size bed. 8 foot doors, 10 foot ceilings, you got the traverse LED lights here, pre-wire for the ceiling fan, and you got two cans for the surround sounds, which all would be an upgrade. This room right here is 14 by 12. If you guys want more information about this property, I, have, I will have it in the link in the description below. 
So we have a tub shower combo, the shower rod. You do have the option to put the glass here. You have a nice floating vanity, 36 inches high. You got the quartz countertops, undermounted sink with a four inch backsplash. And again, you got your Moen product, stainless steel or brushed nickel, I apologize. So it looks like here they are using a transfer grill for the air conditioning. Coming back to the entry, looks like they had collided the ceiling with luxury vinyl. Love the uh, living room here. Love these little nooks that they built out. And again, they had cladded everything with tile. Bring you guys back around. Let's take a look at this. So you have the uh, kitchen, the full built-in. Refrigerator. And this one looks like you have a double stack. And the cabinets, which is really nice. Love this uh, reverse tray ceiling with the LED lights. Pulte is really known for that. So we have this island here. So this island is about 5 by 12, so it's a decent size island with a waterfall. Two front face. Quartz, and they skin the front too with a custom toe kick, which is really nice. Okay. I know it's a little bit dark. I like that window right there. It's really nice. I know it's a little bit dark here. You got your KitchenAid, 48 inch. Magnetic. 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 <laughs> Magnetic. <laughs> 48 upper inch cabinets with the uh, light rail. You do got two ovens here, kitchen, which is really nice. And also you have your convection microwave. Wow, look how large the storage is. Or this walk-in pantry. Wow, this is definitely a decent size. For sure. Yeah. You got your built-in right here. As you know, that's definitely an upgrade. Let's take a look at the island. You got your Blanca dual basin sink under mounted. Then you got your mowing fixtures. Again, your brush nickel. And your dishwasher. So this is a decent size cafe here. Cafe is 12 by 15. Swing back around this way. Definitely has a lot of windows here. And as you can see, you do have a slider here and a slider on the other side. So foot, and also a 12 foot slider. Now all this right here would definitely be an upgrade. You guys already know that, how that works. The uh, cover patio. This is all an upgrade, but let me just show you how this slide works here. Take you guys out to the back. These are uh, almond slides with the color vinyl. Take a look at this. Look how beautiful this is. Wow. This is like the money shot right here. I believe the lot premiums are going to run about 100000 and up. Especially for a view like this. You already know uh, you're not going to get a backyard. Typically the homes like this will have a view fencing. Now what you notice with the age restricted, 
you don't really have block walls. Look at that. It's gorgeous, huh? Just take a minute just to soak that in. At the infinity pool. Nice covered patio, which is really nice. I think the home is definitely facing in the right direction here. Is this a Lennox? Not too sure what brand this is. Yep, it is a Lennox. Not bad. Oh, let's come on this side here and see what we got. Now the air conditioning is a 15 sear unit which tells you it's very energy efficient. Look at this. I'm going to come on this side right here. Now they put the pool pump on this side. Now this is what you need to be aware of. If your master bedroom's here, your headboard's here, right? Your pool pump's gonna be right here. You're gonna hear it. So on this one, the master should be right here. So let's let's go inside to see if we could actually hear it. I would have ran that pool pump on that side. All right, let's go back inside, but before I do that, I'm just going to show you what's going on here. Look at this. Man, that's gorgeous, right? Okay, Thursday between 9 and 11. All right, let's go back inside. As you can see, we have higher ceilings here. The 10 feet, they look like 12 feet. Let's go into the master. Wow, decent sized master, that's for sure. Love the uh, crown. They also clad the ceilings again. Now, I don't know if you guys can hear this or not. Can you guys hear that? Feel the wall. Now, every time it kicks on and cycles, you'll probably be able to hear it. So that would kind of drive me nuts. But your walk-in closet. So you do have some built-ins here. Now, this is from Closets of Las Vegas, okay? These are good people, okay? And I want definitely support this company right here. So if you guys want to check out Closets of Las Vegas, make sure to contact my girl, Pat. They design a lot of closets for a lot of these builders out here. And the customizations that you can do on, on these closets is just like unbelievable. Here's a second closet. So in the bathroom, we have 12 by 24 on the tile. We've got that floating vanity here. Nice backsplash. I definitely would have added some LED lights for sure. I love this spa shower. You do have an option to do a, a tub too as well. You have a zero threshold. Nice bench. Two shower heads and two controls. Got your water closet. Also, one of the options that you can do on here is for the laundry room to have this door takes you right into the laundry. Optional sink, optional refrigerator. And your cabinets above, 42 upper cabinets with a four inch crown. Nice. 
What do we have here? Linen closet. Let's get a different view here. So we have a thermostat here. And I love the fact that we do have a transfer duct here. It sends all the hot heat right directly into the duct. Let's go down this way. Also, I believe you have an option to do a fireplace. Looks like we have another thermostat here. So it's three zones. Let's head down this way. Got your half bath. Get your pedestal sink. You do have an option to put a vanity here as well. And obviously you can add as many lights as you want. I probably would add more. Seems a little bit dark in this half bath. Right across here we do have our two car garage. See if we can get inside. Nope, that is locked. You also have an option to do some custom cabinets here. Your coat closet. You have a two two and a half inch casings around the door. It's actually three. So here's that laundry room. So in this one we have what one, two. That would have been the third bedroom right here, but it is a den. Okay. Let me know what your thoughts are about this property. If you guys can see yourselves living here, okay. Also, just a quick to note: HOAs are three hundred and fifteen dollars a month. But let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are about this property. If you haven't had a chance to subscribe to the channel yet, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Other than that, I'm Chuckets. Have a blessed day.